what is going on my good people this is your main man ben here today guys we got another tech reviews um focusing mainly on vlogging so we're going to talk about a vlogger slide why is it important and why would you want to have one in your bag let's do this So today guys, we're gonna talk about the VGEM VL81 LED light. Now, why would you want to have one of these? If you're traveling, if you're vlogging, and it happens to be you don't have the fastest lens, like the 1.4, 1.8 aperture lenses, you would want to have one of these lights in your camera, trust me. If you're going nightlife or walking in the streets of Thailand or Manila and you don't have a light, once a camera sees a light, it focuses on, on that side because camera is somewhat of painting through light. So it is painting through light. If you don't have one of the lights, then if you're storytelling, you do not have that, you know, some kind of subject and uh, uh, audience connection if you're not focused properly now this is going to resolve that i'm sharing this to you because i think this is the most cheapest light that you can get you don't have to break the bank and it's more than sufficient on what you need and there's a catch this light is bicolor so there's two you know types of temperatures and lights which is if you go a little bit more yellow it's warmer if you go whiter or bluer, it's going to be cold. This has that capacity for color temperature from 3200 to 5600 Kelvin. Talk about the size for this light, guys. This is so small. Um, this is the controller from my softbox. It is literally small. I got a tape measure here for you. If you look at it, it is a square one and uh, literally it's around almost three inches. That's the length of that one, almost three inches. It's square, so it's all even. And it's very light. Maybe your cell phone would be like five more times heavier than this. It's super light. Charging time is around three hours. And I believe you can go with a maximum output of 150 minutes if you go all out with the maximum. And the most minimum brightness you can get out around three hours, maybe four hours of light. Um, let me show you real quick how small this setup is. This is our Sony CVE-10 and look how small the camera is. It looks like the light is towering <laughs> bigger than the camera itself. So if you look at the dimension of the light here, um, it's a little bit more, you know, it's even, which is I like because it's like soft box type so it's boxy you have that you know depending on how far you are when you vlog like this then you have enough distribution of that light coming towards you and it is very light on top of that guys what i like about this light is only two switch operation in the back of the light you can see the power button when you flick up that would be the on and there's battery level here. So one light represents an indicator for that battery. This on the other end of the knob is going to be your temperature control. So you can see in the background of the light, it's changing the color. You can see the reflection in my face is changing from warm, like yellowish, going towards blue, white, around colder. So this is a very simple very simple operation and i'll show you real quick how amazing this light is so we are going to vlog real quick and this is how it looks like when we turn off the softbox we are switching in our cve 10 using the light so what we have right now guys is the kit lens for our sony cve 10 um, we have the Ulanzi light on top of the camera. We're gonna turn it on. And this is how it looks like. See the difference, how dramatic you can pay an impact on a location site where there is no light, 
to voila. Now we're gonna quickly walk here in the stairs since it's one of the darkest spots in the house. All right, I'm gonna try to turn it off again, right there. And we're gonna turn back on how quickly it recognizes it. And you can tell that if you're vlogging, it does make an impact. Now this is the white part of the light. The, let's go a little bit warmer and that would be the warmer side and you can tell that it's very useful if you prefer a warmer tone versus a colder one turning it off again and putting a little bit more juice on the light This is how it looks like. So I hope that's a beach or some kind of street, but it's my basement. Get back to the studio and let's wrap this up. As you can see, this light is amazing. How small it is, how light that you can just slap it in like a Lego in your current setup and continue vlogging and continue sharing that awesome content that you got. On top of that guys, what I most like about this thing is that it has a three point cold shoe mount. So it's your preference if you want your microphone to be mounted in the center, like what we have right now, or in the top, or in this left corner. For what I paid $15 right now, you cannot beat this light. I challenge you if you have a nicer light in here post it in a comment and we'll check it out but other than that for me this Ulanzi VGIM VL81 is a good deal check it out thanks for watching don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button always remember God is good all the time it's your main boy peace out